Hey YouTube, it's American Family Now. Today I'm canning some pickles in our kitchen in our camper, our small home, and I wanted to show you what it looks like when you're canning in a small place. Um, and this is not a tutorial on how to can pickles because to be honest I've never done that before. This is a new experience for me, but I have been canning produce from our garden for a couple of years in this camper, and so some people have been asking how do you do that in such a small place with a small kitchen, and so today I'm going to show you what that looks like. So, here we have my kitchen. This is my table and my sink area and stove. So the canner takes up pretty much the whole stove top. And I have all of my supplies out here on the table. So my first tip for those of you who are considering to can your produce from your garden is to make preparations ahead of time to make sure you have all of your supplies out and do as much of the prep work as possible beforehand to free up space. So for example this morning I washed all the dishes and I also washed all the jars ahead of time that I thought I would need for the pickles and um, took care of all the cleaning supplies. So that was one um, type of supply that I no longer needed to take up room and so I've laid everything out. The kids are all busy with their own projects and so they're not in the way of the canning process either. And I will show you in a little bit what the next step is. Hey YouTube, the next stage of the canning process for our pickles is complete. As you can see this table is a lot cleaner than it was before. So what I've done is I have cut up all the cucumbers as directed and filled the jars and then I cleaned up all of the cooking materials for that process. The other thing that I have done is uh, mix all of the vinegar and water and seasonings together in this pot and I am now waiting for it to boil. Once it is done boiling, I will fill the jars, seal them, uh, put them in the boiling water bath, and then move them out to the storage shed where the rest of our canning supplies are. If you're curious about where we keep all of our canning supplies when we're not using them, they all go, excuse the blur and everything, in the storage shed, which Papa is currently working on putting siding on it today. So obviously we cannot keep everything that we have for canning and garden produ produce in our camper at the moment. Definitely not enough room for it. For example, while the pot of seasonings is boiling, the canner is in the sink because that's where I have room for it. Another thing that I had to keep in mind is that I cannot fill that canner in the camper unless I were to use another container to pour water into it because it is so big that, and I don't have a sprayer in the sink that I couldn't fill it up inside. So what I do is I take it out to our water tank out the window. You can see there's the water tank straight ahead and there's a filter on it and we filter the water, the rainwater, through the hose into the canner and then I lug it all the way back inside again. So, another few seconds I'll show you the next step of the process. And there you have it, six quarts of homegrown, home canned pickles, dill pickles. Next on the list, spaghetti sauce. 